What's up? How you doing? Yes. Is that everybody? Everybody's in. And there's the ambassador Bomani. Oh, he's on the camera as usual. Where is the One Africa family? Where is some of my soldiers so they can see who you are? Come out here. These are some of the One Africa family members. You've seen some of them already. You've met our General Inspector Black Moses is here. This is Brother Latif, Driver Kofi. This is KB. This is your bartender for the three entire days. This is your local artist and entrepreneur. I see Kobe, all my soldiers on the bar, my, all the soldiers on the back, back side, back here, all my soldiers up front right here. This is the One Africa family. You see the soldiers in the yard. You see my brother Dominique, my in-laws are here. We are a big family. You are in a family place. So you should feel home. This is your homecoming. We know that you all have gone through a lot to get here. We know that the ancestors have guided you to be here. As we said, we are in some special high season where the stars, the planets, the cosmic forces are in alignment. They are going on high. So we're keeping this frequency for the next three days very high. And we're gonna to continue to ascend to higher grounds. So whatever you've been dealing with, whatever the things, whatever issues you've had, leave them behind that gate, which is why we put the libation on a merciful plea to the ancestors, we did it in water. Tomorrow we're going to do another one at dawn. So those who want to come out and participate and be at the sunrise service, to calling on the ancestors, we're going to see some more tradition happen to be done. We want you all to relax and be comfortable and enjoy your next three days. We have good food. We're here to enjoy and celebrate your homecoming. We waited a long time to the land to return to the land of your natural ancestral inheritance. And now you are fulfilling prophecy by doing so. Because it has said in many ways, we have been told through so many times throughout our history and tradition that our people will be taken to a strange land where we shall wander in the wilderness. But if we just don't get so caught up by that chaos or get so angry with that heathen system, just return and know who you are. Just reclaim and restore and repair and most of all, remember who you are and return to the land of your natural and ancestral inheritance. And the creative forces will deal with that heathen system that you are dealing with. That's all we have to do. Return. Now you have done it. You have fulfilled prophecy. We are here to meet one another, your African children around. All of these are the children of one African family members. We are all relatives here. You better enjoy your time while you are here. Once again, I got to call my brother, as I usually do, the ambassador. Bomani is not only a One Africa ambassador, because he has a key to many different places for the work that he do. We do not go this moment further without acknowledging all that this brother have done. you in the 15th year? Uh, 14. 14. 2006 when we first met. 2006, we are 14 years. You coming up on 14 years of being Harriet Tubman on the Overground Railroad, going back and forth when you don't have to. You could come and live here just like I do. I've been living here on no home for 24 years with my family, my children. We're all here with each other. Bomani is an official ambassador at One Africa in Ghana here. He has the keys to many different places, and this is one of his places. So Bomani, we would like to say a big, Aiko, ready? One, two, three. Aiko! Appreciate the family. Aiko means you have done well. Who can tell me to be sponsor of Aiko? If I say Aiko! 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 You have done well. And we don't take your work lightly because not everybody can bring souls home and change them into gold. That's what you are doing the official ambassador. We clap for him, y'all. Give him some hands of love. Thank you, Brahmani. Appreciate the family. Brahmani, some we, we say, let's me and you gotta say some, some, some remark with the family from you. I'll take the camera. Cause I want you to be seen on here. 
It's important that we document. Yeah. Yes, family, um, this One Africa has been a historical, special place. I remember the first time coming here in December of 2006. Didn't really know what the future would be. But one, one thing I knew is that we had to start building this relationship. So I met Shabazz and Imacus on that beautiful day um, in mid-December uh, 2006. And we've been the best of friends and business partners for 14 straight years. And we've been working together to really connect with us. And as you see in the last few days, we just have a lot of networking going on. And through that networking strength and energy, that's how we're going to pull this thing off. And it's uh, part of our corporate economics push. Uh, so One Africa is that foundation piece. And I've always told uh, Shabazz I wouldn't trade One Africa in for the five or 10 star resort. And um, it's really the place to be. So appreciate uh, One Africa and its unique uh, elements. Uh, this is a place that was built for us by one of our own brothers and sisters in the diaspora which is our elder sister Imacus uh, from New York City. So family, uh, just want everyone to this, uh, this go with the flow of things and uh, this enjoy paradise. I too. Anybody right off the bat, any one or two questions that you might be concerned about? I see some of the elders returning and anyone want to ask any questions, something they might be concerned about or you want to keep it? We got good food coming up later. You got some of the traditional council. Feel free. Your bags are going to come down. You'll get your room assignments in a moment. Let's play and let's enjoy this house. The family is here, y'all. I share.